following video is not made for kids. Your discretion is advised. Hello to my subscribers, this is the TF Angie coming to you with a what will most likely be the last uh, batch of Transformers figures I get if for quite a while. I'll I'll so. Those of you who subscribed to me for a long time, you know that I am currently looking for a new job. Uh, I'm still searching. Applied to some places, but haven't heard back yet, so hopefully someone will offer me a job soon. But in the meantime, I just want to share with you guys that I had just uh, one last group of Transformers figures. Figures to my collection. Action, so. These will most likely be the very last Transformers I get it for a good while. At least, hopefully, until I get back on my feet again. But for now, the last group of Transformers figures I've added to my Transformers collection are uh, three deluxe figures. First up, we have a Transformers Studio Series Gamer Edition Cliff Jumper, who arrived from Amazon. Amazon the other day. I'm really thrilled to have him in my collection. I'm still debating since I still have my uh, Gamer Edition uh, Bumblebee figure, who you can see right there, just over my. Uh, Shoulder. I'm still trying to decide if I should do separate reviews for both Bumblebee and Cliff Jumper, or if I should review them both at the same time. Since really the only difference is that they have between them is uh, different head scopes and different laser guns. But I'll see, see what see how I go about that. Next up, we have a Transformers figure that I was surprised to get. It from Amazon, and it is Transformers Studio Series 86 Deluxe Class Brawn. And as you can tell, Brawn's box is pretty beat up. Um, Sometimes Amazon, they'll get copies of Transformers figures where the boxes accidentally get damaged during the shipping and handling process when they arrive from the manufacturer's factory to Am one of Amazon's uh, warehouses, and that was the case here with Braun. So I was able to get him uh, marked down $3 from his uh, retail price tag. And um, as of this video's recording, it's now uh, August 11th of 2023, and right now, on Amazon.com, they state that Studio Series 86 Brawn is currently sold out, so... Um, it said in the description that the actual uh, Brawn action figure itself is undamaged. It was just the box that got uh, smushed, smushed down here on the bottom, as you can see. And... E, so... I was, uh, this was... For now, at least, as of this video's recording, this was the last action figure of Brawn that was in stock before he sold out so hopefully Amazon will get more copies of Braun in stock again and but before he went out of stock it said that and on Amazon that the early the latest that Braun could arrive would be the 24th of September so who knows when Amazon's gonna get this figure back in stock uh, hopefully Braun and Cliff Jumper will start to show up at brick and mortar stores soon I believe I saw on the week on the Transformers Wikipedia that uh, Together, a Studio Series 86, uh, I'm sorry, Studio Series Gamer Edition, Cliff Jumper, and Studio Series 86 of Braun. Uh, these guys are the two deluxe class action figures that make up, I believe it's either Wave 20 or 21 of the deluxe class uh, Studio Series figures. So hopefully these guys will start to show up in stores soon. Soon. And so, um, in addition to those two guys, I got one last uh, Transformers Legacy figure, and it's one that I was really surprised to see appear on eBay. I believe this figure is going to be released in a couple of in the coming months as a Walgreens exclusive here in the United States. It's, I'm hoping it's uh, not going to be a ha Hasbro Pulse exclusive because Hasbro Pulse exclusive Transformers, as amazing as they are, they can be a, become really expensive and really hard to get. But for now, the le the what will most likely be E for at least a while. The final Transformers Legacy figure I've added to my Transformers collection. Action, I present you guys with Transformers Legacy Evolution Deluxe Class Autobot Medics. So yes, the uh, first character from Transformers Rescue Bots who's been given a figure in the Transformers Generate, in the overall uh, Transformers Generations line. I'm Legacy Medics is fi finally here. As far as I'm aware of, he's a, going to be a Walgreens exclusive here in the United States, but he has started to appear on eBay. eBay, uh, some people have got on copies of Medics from overseas. Uh, he's uh, This copy of Medics was originally going to be distributed in, Hon distributed in Hong Kong, as you can see by this uh, disclaimer sticker here. 
here. So yes, I'm really thrilled to have this guy in my collection. Uh, this is the fifth version of the uh, Legacy Schizmo old, and um, overall, I'm really thrilled with how Medics came out. out. And um, when he was first revealed several months ago, a lot of Transformers fans and collectors, myself included, didn't think that characters from Transformers Rescue Bots would be given figures in the Legacy lines, but Medics is uh, one of the most recent Transformers characters in Legacy Evolution to show that any Transformers character from any past or previous Transformers series could end up getting released in the Legacy line, so that's really neat there, so thank you guys all so much for watching. This has been my mo this has been will probably be my uh, final haul of Transformers action figures. Definitely my final haul for the month of August. August, I'm really thrilled to have Studio Series 86 Brawn Gamer Edition Cliff Jumper and Legacy Evolution Medics in my Transformers collection. The reviews are coming up. Uh, the weather's been uh, particularly hot where I live, and uh, on hot days, uh, a is my uh, camera equipment uh, doesn't like to function too properly, and uh, and really, and uh, I get tend to get hot and sweaty on camera, so I try to wait for days when it's colder to record reviews. It was, but it was, but make no mistake, the reviews are coming. I mean, I apologize for not getting my reviews out as often as I would like to. Ooh, but thank, thank you guys all so much to my subscribers for your continued support and for your understanding. And it's next time you guys, this has been the TFA Geek. Please wish me luck. Okay, it's next time you guys stay safe, stay health, healthy. Hopefully, I'll be able to get my next review out tomorrow night. Night, and until next time, you guys, Transformers roll out. Goodbye, everyone.